What's up guys? So today we're gonna to talk about vertical video. How you can take your DSLR footage and your mobile footage, throw them into your favorite editing software and then export it in a vertical format that meets the standards of IGTV and Instagram story feed. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is what to do if you already have a project completed. And then I'm gonna show you what to do if you've got raw clips that still need to be edited, upscaled and put together. I've got some clips uploaded in my computer in the back. So we'll head back there and get started. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna show you is what to do if your project is already completed. Just go ahead into whatever project you want exported, go ahead and open it up. What you're gonna to wanna to do is create a compound clip of everything that is inside of your project. So go ahead and select all, right click, new compound clip. Go ahead and copy that and start a new project. Now in the video format selection, you wanna select custom and you want 1080 by 1350. That is the video format for Instagram, 1080 by 1350. Select OK. Paste that compound clip in the new project. And as you see here, it's still in its widescreen format and it's not fitting the dimensions of the 1080 by 1350 frame. So this is where you gotta scale it. Let's come up here towards the scale all and you're gonna to wanna to input 223. And that's it. Just keep in mind if you have any titling or any lettering, uh, like right here across the screen, it will get cropped out. But that's it, then go ahead and export it like you normally would. All right, so next I'm gonna show you what to do if you've got clips that still need to be edited and upscaled. Here I got three clips. Uh, this one I shot on my DSLR. You'll see the image is sideways because I turned my camera vertically. The second clip is my DSLR held in its up, normal upright position. And here I shot this on my mobile phone in a vertical position. As you can see, each all, all of them need to be scaled, but the scaling is just a little bit different. So first, with the shot, when I held my DSLR vertically, to get it upright, you're gonna to wanna to rotate it 270 degrees. So after you got it rotated 270, you wanna scale it up to 180. Here's a clip of the DSLR held upright in its normal position. Scaling for this is exactly the same as we did with the completed project. When your DSLR is held upright, the scaling is 223. Now for your mobile footage, the scale here is gonna be 144. All right, y'all, that's all I got. Thanks for watching. Peace.